Hi, Julie here, Thought Field Therapy Tapping Advanced Practitioner and Trainer. I'm so happy to be with you here today to be sharing with you a wonderful, effective, evolutionary technique for releasing, letting go, and aligning with a new you. We're going to be maximizing this potent energy right now as we're coming into this new moon this energy of letting go, of releasing all that no longer serves you, and facilitating this process with simple to use TFT tapping techniques and a brief meditation along with it. Centering in on your wholeness, your fullness, your absolute health and well being, and the infinite love that is ever present within you. Very simply put, if you've never heard of Thought Field Therapy tapping, it's like a combination of acupuncture without the needles and psychology. What you do is while we're tapping on specific meridian points on your body, you're going to be focusing in on specific thought fields. And this gives spe specificity to the energy of what it's working on, what it's clearing, what kind of blocks it's removing in your system so that you can align with a happier, healthier you. So we'll go ahead and get started. And first, I'd like you to focus in on anything that you're wanting to release or let go of in your life. This could be something that is showing up externally. I also highly recommend though that you look within, look within to the deeper parts of yourselves, any aspects of yourself that you'd like to let go of. You may have been noticing lately <laughs> a more magnified experience of the quote negativity coming up in your life so maybe it's feeling frustrated or your negative beliefs or your self-doubt your feelings of unworthiness this stuff is coming up to the surface to be released at a whole new level and we're going to facilitate this process with some tapping techniques easing you into this new expression of yourself in a more um, whole way in a more self-loving way you can even pause the video right now if you'd like to and write down five to ten things, aspects that you'd like to let go of, that you don't want to move forward with anymore, that you're really ready, ready to release. This can be on a big level the illusion of separation and the illusion of there's something wrong happening in my life, in the world. So we're going deep here. <laughs> okay, so go ahead and it's okay if you don't want to write down five to ten things. This process will still work if you don't. You can follow along with me now. And we're going to be working with five meridian points that are specifically really good to tap for releasing the blocks to letting go and allowing our natural healing system to kick into gear and to facilitate this process with a little more ease and a little more joy. So just focus in. Take a couple of nice deep breaths, focusing your awareness on releasing anything and everything that is no longer serving your highest good. You're going to start by tapping the side of hand. So this is our first meridian point that you're going to be tapping here. Focusing on releasing anything and everything that no longer serves your highest good, your highest joy. Tapping under your nose. I am releasing all that no longer serves my highest good. And then the center of your chin and knowing that what's for your highest good is for the highest good of all. So this is contributing to the well-being of all as well. Next you're going to tap the middle finger point up by the base of your nail on the side facing your index finger, focusing on releasing anything and everything that is no longer serving your highest good. All limiting beliefs, emotions, patterns, ways of being that are no longer serving your highest good. Next, you're going to tap the outside corners of your eyes, right about there. You're tapping them gently so you're not hurting yourself in any way, but strong enough so that you're activating that meridian point. Releasing anything and everything that's no longer serving your highest good. And go through that again. So tapping the side of the hand. Notice I switched hands. You're welcome to switch to the other side as well. It doesn't matter though. And next you're going to tap under your nose. I am releasing 
everything that no longer serves my highest good. Releasing and letting go, center your chin with ease, with peace. Middle finger, I'm letting go of all that no longer serves my highest good. Easily and effortlessly, releasing, releasing the past, anything that I've been bringing in to my present from my past that no longer serves me. Good. One more time through, so we're gonna do it three times total. Tapping the side of your hand again, releasing anything and everything that no longer serves me or my purpose. And then under your nose, I am releasing all and everything that no longer serves me or the highest good. Center of your chin, I am releasing, letting go, allowing myself to let go. Middle finger point of all that no longer serves me. Allowing myself to be free in my expression. Allowing myself to feel good, to feel prosperous, to feel loved. Letting go of all that no longer serves me. Very good. And just take notice of how you're feeling now. Notice if it's shifted at all from when you started to do the tapping. Good. Good. Moving forward, I've used advanced level um, TFT tapping techniques to diagnose a specific sequence for anybody that's tapping along with this video to dial in specifically to our energy systems and release blocks, release all the things that are no longer serving us. This gives our tapping more specificity and more precision to this release and letting go. So first point, while focusing on, we are releasing all that no longer serves our highest good. You're gonna tap the side of your hand. Don't worry if you don't remember the statement. You're already in that thought field, in the awareness, releasing all that no longer serves our highest good. Next, you're gonna tap the beginning of the eyebrow, this point here. You can tap both of them if you'd like, or just one. Next, you're gonna tap the outside corner of the eye. You're releasing all that no longer serves our highest good. And then under the arm, right about four inches below where the armpit would hit. If you want to tap both, you can do that. Doesn't matter though. Next, you're gonna tap under your nose. I am releasing anything and everything that no longer serves, that no longer serves me. And then center of your chin. Good. Next, you're gonna tap under your eye. I am releasing all that no longer serves my highest good. Next is gonna be side of the hand again. Very good. Then you're gonna tap the index finger point, which is up by the base of your nail. Tap there. I'm releasing all that no longer serves my highest good. And then again, under the arm. And you can focus in on any, any tension or contraction you might be feeling right now and focus in on releasing that. Releasing any and all fears, any doubts. And next, you're gonna tap the chin. This is the last point here. I am releasing anything and everything that no longer serves my highest good. Good. Take a couple of nice deep breaths in and out. You're doing a great job. And just notice anything that's shifting in you, anything that's coming up, that's bubbling up to the surface. Letting go, releasing. Good. Now we're gonna focus in now to wrap up this video 
on one thing that you're wanting to create in your life. So now that you've done the practice of letting go, of releasing, you're going to step into the fulfillment and the embodiment of something that you want to actualize, that you want to create in your life. And you want to embody that energy, that vibration right here and right now. So feel free, you can pause the video. If you already know what you want to do, let's go ahead and just bring that into your awareness. One thing that you want to uh, create in your life. So it could be a happy, healthy relationship. It could be better meditations. It could be more success, more um, reach in your business, being able to reach more people with what you're bringing into the world. It could be uh, fully expressing yourself on stage when you're singing. Anything that works for you. Focus in on that. Good. And now we're going to tap to release any and all blocks to embodying that vision right here and right now. Again, we're going to tap the side of the hand. So we're going through those five meridian points again that are really great for releasing blocks to embodying this visualization right here and right now. So focusing in on that thought field, whatever it is you're wanting to create, I'm releasing all blocks to embodying this right here and right now, this vision right here and right now. Tapping center of your chin. Could be physical well-being. So if it's physical well-being, I'm releasing all blocks to embodying optimal physical health and well-being right here and right now. Next, you're going to tap your middle finger point. I am living in alignment with this embodiment of my highest vision, my heart's visions, my soul's visions, tapping outside of the eye, releasing all blocks to embodying this vision right here and right now for the highest good. Very good. Excellent. Excellent. Take another couple of nice deep breaths in and out. I'm just noticing what's moving within you Maybe you have some new insights, some new ahas, some new visions. <laughs> Tapping's a pretty wonderful thing because what happens is sometimes you can just notice different scenes going through your inner awareness as you're tapping, as different layers are being cleared, as new ideas are coming to you. So just be present to what's happening for you right now. And we're all moving forward together in this magnificent time on earth where truly anything is possible and when we come together in unity, as community, as friends, we are so magnified in our potential. So please, if you like this video, like it, share it with your friends, let's empower each other, let's come together in our wholeness, in our fullest self-expression from our hearts, from our joy, from our passion, from our infinite abundance and prosperity and well-being. Thank you so much for joining me today. Leave a comment below. Let me know how this was for you. I'd love to learn more about you. I'd love to know what your dreams are, what your visions are. Go ahead and pop them in in the comments area. And I truly, truly wish you the most magnificent new moon experience, manifestations of your dreams and optimal health and well-being for you and your loved ones. I'll see you again very soon. Take care.